John here for the Best Buy Canada blog and today I'm going to show you how you can set up your Chromebook to play Google Stadia. I'll show you how to connect the Stadia controller and also how you can use your PlayStation 4 or Xbox controller to play Stadia on your Chromebook. So let's take a look at the Stadia controller. We're going to use the USB-C cable to plug it into the top of the Stadia controller, like so. Then you're going to use any of the USB-C ports on the Chromebook to plug it in. And there you go. Your Stadia controller is now linked with your Chromebook and ready to go. Now let's take a look at setting up the Xbox One controller on the Chromebook for use to play with Google Stadia. The first thing you need to do is to set your Xbox One controller into pairing mode. You can do this by pressing the Xbox button and then holding the sync button at the top. You'll see that the Xbox button here will flash and now you'll go over to the Chromebook down by the time you'll click and where it says Bluetooth, you'll hit the down arrow and this will search for all available Bluetooth devices. Here you can see the Xbox wireless controller. I'm going to select it. And look, as you can see, it's connecting with the device and the controller is now linked. It's that easy. Now we're going to look at how you set up and pair the DualShock 4 controller to the Chromebook to play Stadia. On the DualShock 4 controller, you'll need to press and hold the PlayStation button along with the Share button. You'll know that it's, that it's set into pairing mode when the light bar flashes white. Now, we'll go to the Chromebook, click down by the time, and where the Bluetooth is, we'll hit the down arrow. From there, we're going to look to see, wait for the PlayStation 4 controller. It shows up as a wireless controller. I'll click on it. And just like that, the light bar is now a blue-purple color, and the controller is linked. So now that we've got a controller linked to the Chromebook, what you're going to want to do is make sure that your Chromebook has the latest version of Chrome and all the updates. To do this, we're going to click here down by the time. And then we're going to click on this little gear into settings. And from settings, we're going to go to about Chrome OS. And here we're going to click on check for updates. So at the time of this video, my Chromebook is up to date. Now we're going to navigate to the Stadia website. I've created a shortcut down here, but the URL is stadia.google.com, as you can see up here. So now you can see the controller is linked, and we're ready to go. And that about wraps it up. I hope you enjoyed my video on how to set up your Chromebook to play Google Stadia.